morning, everybody. Brian B. Catfishing here, and today I'm gonna to show you the rig that I use 99% of the time when I'm out cat. First, you're gonna start off with your line. This is a 60 pound line. I'm gonna take about two feet. Take that, clip it. Put that here. Then you're gonna take your hook and your line. Let's get this weight secured. Take the line, go through the front, bring it down a little bit. You're gonna loop it around the hook. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten, and the eleventh time when you go around, you're gonna take the end, go back to the back, pull it up, boom, she locked on there, she's not going nowhere. I gave it enough, just enough to do so I don't have to clip the tag in, but if you have long access of line in the back, Clip the tag in a little. Then what I'm gonna do is take the spook. Uncle Lou's spook. I'll take it through. I'm gonna bring this line about two inches. Two inches from the hook. Go through the hole, and then you're gonna go through it again. Once you go through the second time, Pull it, make sure it's tight. Then go through the top, bottom one. If you have that, some just have one hole there. This one has two at the bottom. Take it through there. And you can see, then what I'm gonna do is pull it tight, hold it in place, take the other end, and go back through it. It's pretty much gonna lock it in, boom. Lock me. See? Then the top front. Take it through the eye. Then take it to the, through the eye again. And boom, it's locked. It's not going nowhere. It's not moving closer to the hook. And it's not moving up the line at all. It's locked in place. And then what I'm going to do with that, once you do that, you have this. Uncle Lou hook, Uncle Lou's rattle. You're gonna take your three-way swivel. Put this on the bottom. Put this through like this. Hold it at the end. Take it around about seven times. Three, four, five. Six, seven. Then you're gonna take that in. And take it through this hole. Hold it. With your line. Cinch it down. Clinch knot, the access, clip it. It's not going anyway. Okay. Then have your line from your rod. You want to take this part. Take the line, you're gonna put it to the top part. Take this through, same as the night before. Get some line, 
Take it one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And the reason I did it about ten times, I'm gonna go around one more time. Eleven, bring it through that opening. If I can get it right. Put your line. Bring it through. Cinch it down. Wrap it around. Tighten it. Oh. She's tight. See, this is the tag in I was saying. If you got extra tag in, clip it. Take your clip, put it on that side. Squeeze the clip, Uncle Lou's clip, run it through, boom, got your clip. You can put on here, you can drop your dragon weight on here, that's why I use a clip. It's easier to take a weight off than put heavy or lighter weight or switch it from a regular weight to a uh, dragon weight in a matter of seconds. Squeeze it again. Boom. Flip it on there. We gone fishing, fishing. Everything is attached. You got your weight, main line, and your hook. Boom. Then when you finish, you want to think about these clips. When you finish, Take it, squeeze it, if I can get it, squeeze it, and take it off, boom, put it back in your tackle box, take your hook, bring it on down, Oh, a little tight. Uh, I actually started with a, a new song tonight, Love Transcendent. That was a new song. Bring it down. Another new song for you guys right here. Put it in the hooks back. When we were rehearsing, we kind of realized this song kind of sounds like a sequel to it. You're ready to roll. Weight gone all. Boom. So, not dragging around, not beating up your rod. You're ready to go. Get back somewhere, throw it back on, or whatever you need to do. Your rod's protected that way, and you ain't gotta worry about it snagging or getting hooked on your other rod lines. That's just the way I do mine. Other people do other things, but this actually works. I tied everything together off of the three-way swivel with the clinch knot. Thank you for watching. First time viewing, click the subscribe button. Hit the thumbs up for me, please and click on the bell so you get notified every time I go live or I upload a video. Once again, thank you for watching. Brian B. Catfishing, out.